everything in life works in perfect balance. So if you're having a hard time right now, I promise you within that difficult time that you're going through, there are equal amount of gifts and treasures. We don't always see them. The key to life is when you're in the challenges, being able to see the good and know that it's part of a divine plan. And I think what's helped me to get there, because we all have challenges, and of course how we handle them is what's key, has been sitting quietly, breathing in nature. I feel very, very blessed to be able to do this in Malta. We've got several on this magnificent land areas where our guests can go and just sit quietly, be with themselves, be with the power, as you can hear, of the flowing water, which actually puts us back in the flow of life, away from blockages. And nature heals us, you know. Um, think about if you need grounding, get out and walk in bare feet. It's been proved within seven seconds of walking in bare feet, all of your cells start to change. They start, the atoms start to rotate in a different manner. Get your shoes off and ground is one thing. If you feel you're too much in your head, grounding's key. If you feel you're stuck in your life and you don't know where to go, get next to some flowing water. Walk by a river, sit by a beautiful water fountain. Allow nature to show us and heal us. Don't doubt the power of nature, guys, because I'm here to tell you, look at what comes from nature, everything. Everything we eat, all the abundance you could ever dream of. Look around at it, it's magnificent. Take in the magic of nature. If you're feeling a bit down and depressed, the sunshine is our greatest energy giver. When you do some sun gazing and you allow that sunshine to come into the third eye, down to the heart, from the heart, back up to the sun, into creating this triangle, you start to invite more light in. Try and look at the sun for 10 minutes a day. Just really tune into it. There's some secrets about the sun. It's the son of God that we've heard. And I'm not a religious person in any way, shape or form, but I'll tell you what I have learned and what I have studied. And there's an aeroplane, so I don't know if you can hear that, but I'm looking up at the sky. So another way to be uplifted is just to look at the sky, allow ourselves to be uplifted. Looking at the stars at night, knowing where we came from. But yeah, I'm not a religious person and I never would put religion down anyone's throat. But when I've actually studied the science of this stuff, it's all metaphors. The sun is actually the son of God. It is there. It blesses everything. Nothing would grow. Nothing would be created. So why aren't we tuning into the sun? Why aren't we tuning into life giving water? That's what I'd urge you to do, to get out in nature and look for the answers. We're very blessed in Malta to be able to do that. So I hope to see you soon here and I can share some of our magic energy, beautiful scenery, grounding techniques and the energy work we do, always working on our life force energy so that you can literally achieve anything you put your mind to. It really is easier than you think when you master the rules of the game of life.